My name is Cornell West. I'm professor of the practice of public philosophy here at Harvard Divinity School and Afro-American Studies. And I have been committed in my life to what the Greeks call paideia, P-A-I-D-E-I-A, -E which is deep education, not cheap schooling. And that deep education has to do with trying to unearth the truth. And the condition of truth is to allow suffering to speak. And one of the forms of suffering I have been deeply concerned about is the suffering that flows from the vicious legacy of white supremacy. I was blessed to write a book over 20 years ago called Race Matters. And I've been blessed to teach that book in classrooms as well as in prisons. Uh, I've been blessed to teach that book in community centers as well as synagogues and temples and churches. And it has to do with the power of paideia that can change lives, that can transform souls, that can engage in a formation of attention, the shift from the lies and the superficial formulations about race tied to innocence and following James Baldwin to try to show the violence underneath that innocence, the psychic violence of demeaning and devaluing people of color, especially black people, the physical violence of what black people went through under 244 years of white supremacist slavery, of course, on the Jim Crow with the lynching and every two and a half days, some black body hanging from some tree uh, in the history of American terrorism in this country. How do we undergo education so that we produce compassion, empathy, fortitude? And fortitude is more than courage. Fortitude is the combination of courage and greatness of character, or magnanimity, the fusion of courage and magnanimity produces fortitude. And I come from a people who have been terrorized, stigmatized, and traumatized for 400 years, but we have produced figures of great fortitude. The Frederick Douglasses, the Ida B. Wells Barnetts, the Martin Luther Kings, the Malcolm Xs, the Ella Bakers, the Fannie Lou Hamers, the John Coltrane's, and Sarah Vaughn's, and Ray Charles and the Hutchison sisters of the emotions and sly stones. That's my tradition. The tradition that has been dealing with race matters, dealing with how in the face of so much hatred you can still try to teach the world how to love. Mm -hmm.